Detective, do you recognize what you've just seen? Do you, do you know where we're at, what we're looking at? Yes. Where, where are we at? This should be the hip barn roof that I had mentioned earlier, and they're just some of the kennels in there. Okay, so is it fair to say that we're on the property now on Shepherd Road that you went up to? Yes. All right. Yes. <coughs> and this is the hip barn with some of the kennels you mentioned? Yes, it is. All right. Now you would agree with me that in this still photo, where we stop this, there's a white bucket. Yes. What's in that white bucket? I believe that is frozen uh, ice. Okay. Now, detective, you see an individual just walked into the frame and is uh, opening the gate. Is that correct? That part of the screen is completely. Uh, you can stand up and walk out with it. We'll help you see it. You may judge. It. Yes, that's thank you, bro. Yes, that back. Can you see better there? Much better. All right. Do you see an individual opening that screen door? I do. Who is that? Uh, Sharon Evans. Okay, and is Sharon present in the courtroom today? She is. Where is she? See her right here. Judge asked for a request. She's identified the defendant slash respondent without objection. So during it, during this, while you're looking at these animals, is it fair to say that Ms. Evans accompanied you? Yes. Okay. Go ahead and continue to play. You see, there appears to be some type of a, uh, a dog house, for lack of a better word. Is that correct? Correct. Tell us a little bit about that. What you observed during this time, I don't recall myself being a part of this. Yeah. I, I certainly would have been in that building because what occurred after this. Yeah. But I don't uh, recall this incident itself. I don't recall exactly uh, where that dog came from that I had cut the binder twine off. Okay. We'll continue. Right there, you're, you're attempting to remove binder twine from the dog's foot. 
That's correct.
to an engine. Okay, so what we're looking at right there, tell us what that is. That's the banker's line. Uh, it's a plastic form instead of the rope style that is wrapped around his leg. And I'd say it was a, an entire piece um, that had, did not have cuts on either end from growing up on a farm, which would be about uh, roughly nine, ten foot long. And it's mostly getting cut out at this point. Several strands are so tight, I just had to keep on cutting through more and more strands. So that's what we're looking at. So what's your estimation that this piece was, was approximately nine to ten feet long that you wrapped around this dog's paw? That's correct. Thanks, Thanks,